We're going to be crossing over uh, in this boat to a village uh, on the other side of this uh, water. Um, Community World Service Asia with support of its partners, including CWS, uh, Church World Service uh, Japan, is, um, is going to be supporting that village um, with immediate emergency relief. Um, where once we're there, uh, we'll share more footage from from that area. But this is 100% um, of the families of the houses uh, in this area have been uh, displaced. We're we're currently passing through the village. We are inside the village. This is the village. As you can see, of course, it's completely inundated. I mean, you can't even step down here. These are houses. They're all abandoned. Most of these families are either settling on the road outside in temporary shelters. Um, a lot of them don't even have um, tents or anything. They've just made shelter out of cloth and stuff. And um, many of these families depended on um, daily wages, um, labor work. They don't have any right now. That have still that have still stayed back. They wanted to protect their belongings, some of their assets. We're still in the middle of the village. As you can see, there's no place where we can actually get down. All these houses, all the people in these houses, these entire communities have been displaced. There were 2,700 plus people living here. This building, this, this building was a school, it was a girls' school. Naturally, I mean, this is closed and all the children who used to go to the schools now have been uh, without any access to education since over a month. This is the school. These are houses nearby. Some more houses nearby. As you can see, the houses that were constructed with cement and bricks, they have survived, but obviously they're they cannot be lived in at this point. This is a school. Yep. We are standing in district Mirpukhas and uh, Tehsil Jodo and uh, the houses are all damages and uh, they uh, losses in the houses, crops and livestock and um, everything is lost but they need immediately shelter, food, hygiene, health facilities, animal vaccinations, mosquito nets and moss pels and um, so many things.